We all work hard to become the best we can and to get that bread, of course. But at the same time, we all need to unwind from the stress every so often. For some, it can be hitting up parties, going out. But for others like me, it's staying in and playing their favorite games as a way to de-stress. Well, like you and me, our computers need to be able to do both. This is especially true if you're someone who works from home most of the time. You will need a capable and, of course, a dependable PC for all your tasks and, of course, your gaming needs. And with the new Intel Core Desktop Processor 14 Gen, you can easily work and play games without any issues. What's up, guys? Say here from Yugatech, and today we'll be checking out the new Intel Core Desktop Processor 14 Gen, this baby right here. To show you just how important a reliable PC that can both work and play, we sourced out this new Intel Core i7 14700K processor and we fitted it into our Asus desktop rig with an RTX 4080 GPU. I'm sure you want to know more, so let's get right into it. If you've been following our channel for quite some time, you've probably noticed just how capable these Intel processors are. If not, you can check out our previous videos on the Intel Core 13th Gen processors right here. Moving on, the new Intel Core Desktop Processor 14th Gen builds on the reputation of the 13th Gen chipset, but features several performance improvements. Effectively, you can think of it as a faster and better version of the Raptor Lake chips we already love that was released last year. Best of all, this still costs the same price as before. Specifically with this new Intel Core i7-14700K processor, there are more cores, improved performance, and as well as improved efficiency. It comes with a total of 20 cores, 8P cores, and 12 E cores. In comparison to its predecessor, that's 4 more E cores than the i7-13700K had, giving it a big advantage in performance without any added cost. That also means you have better performance for gaming, creation, and as well as anything you can think of. At the same time, the new Intel Core Desktop Processor 14th Gen also uses the same LGA1700 socket as the 12th and 13th Gen Intel processors. So if you want to upgrade to the new 14th generation processors, you don't necessarily have to change your motherboard. Just change the processor and you're good to go. I mean, that's what we did with the Asus rig we have. But enough talk about the Intel Core Desktop Processor 14th Gen. Let's move on to the exciting part. Testing the performance of the new Intel Core i7 14700K processor paired with the powerful RTX 4080 GPU in our Asus test rig. Given the specs, we do have very high expectations. And as expected, it runs most of the tasks we do here at the Yugatech HQ with ease. Here at our HQ, we use our desktops to do everything. And by everything, I literally mean it. From light writing work to editing videos and even playing games in our free time, we do it all on our PCs here at the HQ. In terms of workload, we were able to edit and render videos on Premiere and After Effects while simultaneously having Photoshop and Lightroom running in the background. Not surprisingly, this chipset can handle it all. There was no slowing down whatsoever, even when rendering videos and editing photos in Lightroom at the same time. Mind you, we were also playing music via Spotify, had Google Chrome turned on and several tabs open and we could still work very, very efficiently. So if you're someone who likes to multitask like me, this is really perfect for you. But if you're not convinced just yet, here's how the chipset performed using our usual benchmarking apps. Now, don't let the powerful specs fool you. Intel's 14th gen desktop processors aren't just for work. I mean, that's why they're powerful. They're also perfect for gamers, just like most of us here at the Yucatec HQ. Just keep the secret from our boss. My game of choice with this test rig is Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Given the powerful Intel Core desktop processor, it ran the game very easily without any issues whatsoever. Even with the settings tweaked to max, we were able to get an average of around 130 to 140 FPS constantly even with all the explosions going on. Just take a look at the gameplay footage to see how great it is at handling modern warfare. There were no FPS drops whatsoever or even slowing down, even if we had Chrome along with other apps running in the background. But aside from Call of Duty, some of my colleagues also used the rig to play Valorant and ran it perfectly. Even with Lightroom and Photoshop running, there were no frame rate drops in Valorant and they enjoyed a nice game in between editing or along with their breaks. Between writing scripts and editing photos, I also did my dailies in Genshin Impact and with everything maxed out, the 14th gen processor handled it beautifully. Just shows that it's a great combo for playing and as well as work. 
So, we're quite convinced with the capabilities of the new Intel Core desktop processors 14th gen. It's perfect for both work, play, and everything else. No wonder Intel's tagline with these new processors is Game, Create, Stream, without compromise. It works great for us, and I'm sure it will be the same for you guys. While we did try out the i7 14700K, there are other Intel Core desktop processors available to suit your budget and needs. If you're a hardcore gamer craving for the absolute best performance, the i9 processors in Intel's 14th generation lineup are your ultimate weapon. However, if that level of power feels overkill for you along with the i7, the i5 series offers an excellent alternative that still packs a powerful punch without breaking the bank. If you're interested in building a new rig or upgrading your current setup, you can now order the new Intel Core Desktop Processors 14 Gen. It's the perfect time to order too, since you can have them installed into your computers by the holiday season. Spoil yourselves this Christmas and your computer by upgrading your processor. If you plan on upgrading or building a new PC, why not consider the new Intel desktop processor 14 Gen? Given the chance, will you be making the shift to Intel? Because I already use it and I would. Now, are you already an Intel user? Share your thought about the new 14th generation processors in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video or at least found it informative, do hit that like button and subscribe to our channel to watch more. Don't forget to click that bell icon to be notified of future uploads. Also, don't forget to follow us on our social media channels, which is Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, and visit yugatech.com to stay updated with the latest tech news and reviews. Once again, this has been Jose, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. See ya. I'll be taking this home.